What's up guys, Not Super Mario here and welcome to another video of today as promised Birds of Prey official trailer just dropped. I'm not gonna talk anything about it before the trailer. Let's just see it. You know what a Harlequin is? A Harlequin's role is to serve. It's nothing without a master. No one gives two shits who we are beyond that. The Joker and I broke up. Oh. I wanted a fresh start. Put a name on Toya. It turns out I wasn't the only Damon Gotham looking that? for emancipation. Spectacular. Oh, no. Black Oh, Venus. Miss Quinn, she brought me. Oh, is that Victor's ass? Who are you guys? Chick. I'll accept broad lady woman and on occasion bitch. Bitch? What are you talking Hold about? for me, will you? <laughs> okay. Okay. So, uh, what do I think about this trailer? Uh, it really focuses on Harley Quinn, Margot Robbie's character. She looks phenomenal. Like, she was the best part of Suicide Squad. And that's why they're making this, like, her as the main character because she was so phenomenal in a movie that wasn't really good, at least in my opinion. But I don't know what to think about the show. It looks really good. Costumography, is that the word? I mean, the costume design is incredible. I mean, all the costumes we got to see, it looks phenomenal. Cinematography looks phenomenal. But we got to see every other character. We got to see Renee Montoya. We got to see Huntress. We got to see Black Canary, I think. Cassie Kane. We got to see Black Mask without his mask. I hope there's a mask. Because that, that's like his signature thing about him. Is this Black Mask being a menacing like guy. And I think that was Victor Zass. So Victor Zass, if you don't know from the comics. And I don't know if that's... that's 100% true, but he's very scarred. I think he did that to himself for every single uh, person that he killed. He made like a scar to himself and he doesn't look very scary, if you know what I mean in this. Not that I want a 100% iteration from the comics, but Victor Zez in the comics it looks terrifying. It looks really terrifying just to look at him because he's so he has so much scars. So this trailer, did it make me excited? Yes, it did. Did, did it do its job to, to, for me to be like, oh my gosh, this was something phenomenal. This is like, like the Kingsman trailer did yesterday. No, it didn't. But this is only the first official trailer. It's a teaser trailer. Well, well it says a trailer. So it's not even a teaser trailer. We got to see the whole group, everybody, some great action, but to be completely honest, I wanted something more. I, th I don't know what, but <laughs> I didn't get what was I what I was expecting or hoping to get. I'm still excited for this. DC is doing their own thing, and so far, they're kind of succeeding at it. Uh, uh, of course, Wonder Woman, big success. Aquaman, big success. Shazam was great. There, tomorrow I'm seeing Joker that is like, everybody's saying that is phenomenal. They're doing 
their own Batman spin on, Matt Reeves with uh, Robert Pattinson. So, so they're going in the right direction. But this trailer didn't make me feel, oh, yes, this is the right thing that we have to do. I don't know. I hope I, I feel differently when I see more. And I think I will, but this trailer did, uh, did leave me underwhelmed, unfortunately. But that's me. Share your opinion in the comments down below. What do you think about this trailer? Do you feel the same as I do? Or do you think this was the best thing ever? Maybe it was for you. For me, it wasn't, but it was still good. So let's not confuse what I'm trying to say here. The trailer was good, but it wasn't awesome. Let's say it like that. That's the simple, simplest way to say it. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, hit that subscribe button, share this video all over the place, click that bell icon to get notified when I upload, and I'll see you next time. Bye!